Hey everybody, Keith Dotson here and in this video we will be photographing some New England maritime sites, specifically in the city of Salem, Massachusetts. Of course, Salem is known for the witch trials which occurred here in the 1690s and has in recent years fully embraced a spooky, witchy Halloween town persona as a means to promote tourism, but the city has been a major seaport since the early days. Since I live in a place that's inland and decidedly not near a seacoast, it was a treat for me to be able to shoot these coastal locations. We're starting here in the Salem Maritime Park in downtown Salem, where there's an old ship docked and a sail loft building that's several hundred years old. If you look closely at the figurehead on the front of the boat, you can see that it's wearing a Santa cap, which is kind of funny. Next we're off to Winter Island Park, which is very historic and has been used since the 1600s as a location for drying fish, for example. It holds a colonial era military fort, which is Fort Pickering, which has been used since then for the Civil War and some other things. And um, it's where the frigate Essex was launched in the 1790s. And it holds an old Coast Guard seaplane hangar, which was built in 1934, and some uh, Coast Guard barracks which are now abandoned and boarded up and off limits. Salem's a historically a busy harbor town and it still is and the harbor master is headquartered on Winter Island as well. Here we're looking at a bunker that was built I believe during the Civil War era of uh, Fort Pickering. There are several of these on the location. I haven't looked at the history to see what these were used for exactly. And there's the Fort Pickering Lighthouse built in the 1870s. Trying to find my way down to get the best viewpoint. Not a bad place to hang out. Across the bay uh, from us there is Marblehead, Massachusetts.
I want to apologize for all the wind noise. As you can tell, it was super windy the entire time I was in Massachusetts, probably because we're on the coast. These are the Coast Guard barracks. You know I love an abandoned building. I'm not sure the date on these. Uh, as I said earlier, the hangar was built in the 1930s, but I expect that these probably predate that by quite a bit, maybe turn of the century or earlier. They're trying to get funding in Salem to uh, rehab the building and put it to use. Right now it's pretty exposed to the elements and it's not gonna survive if they don't do something pretty soon. This is a photograph of the hangar. Apparently I got no video, but at least I did get an image of it. Self-portrait with a tree shadow. And behind the hangar, there was a lot of driftwood with rusty old chains that just looked amazing. That's it, everybody. Thanks for watching. Be sure to visit my website, keithdotson.com.